Hey guys, this is the Great Lugia here. Ah. Welcome to Pokemon Emerald Version, the go through, part 19. And this guy is annoying! All because of one specific Pokemon. I did the first time, he completely walled me. The battle would have taken like 45 minutes or something ridiculous like that. I'm not gonna do that. After that, I grinded Aron up to level 26, as that was the only Pokemon that could do any damage to it. And I also grinded up Loudred to level 26, too, for good measure. Grovile's the same. Aron's moves are the same, but it tried learning takedown, didn't let it, mainly because it doesn't have Rockhead. So I tried battling him again. Still completely walled! So now, I actually gave Loudred a certain... Move I hate. Yup. I gave it Rock Smash. Because I have a feeling that's the only way I'm going to have a chance of beating this guy. Alright, let's get this over with. I've given up on my plans to convert the city I have. And so, I put my time into making door traps in my gym. Oh, now, what are you doing here? What's that? You say you've gotten past all my ready doors. <laughs> now, that's amusing. Then I, Watson, the leader of Millville Gym, shall electrify you. And probably none of that came out on the mic, but I don't care. This guy is friggin' possessed. I hate you. He leads off with Voltorb, level 20, pure electric. Its ability is soundproof. It knows rollout, spark, self-destruct, and shockwave. I led with Aron, since if it uses self-destruct, hopefully it shouldn't be able to do too much to A, Aron's amazing physical defense, and B, quad resistance. Alright, that did a good amount. Ye yeah, that was a crit! You fail, Voltorb. Alright, now for his second Pokemon, Electrike. Male, also level 20. Pure electric. Its ability is static. Its moves are quick attack, leer, howl, and shockwave. So, essentially the only thing it can do to me again is shockwave. Howl isn't gonna matter at all. And, okay, that did a decent amount. And I'm not going to risk going for headbutt, if only for the fact that, uh, what's it? Then I might get, um, paralyzed with static, which I would not like. Alright then, now for the bane of my existence. I'm just switching into this so I can heal Aron. Magneton! Level 22. Its ability is Magnet Pulp. Its moves are Supersonic, Thunder Wave, Sonic Boom, and Shock Wave. I cannot tell you how much this thing hates me. First up, I'm just gonna go and heal Aron with a Super Potion. No, that's not quite enough. Soda Pop, then. This thing completely walls Grovile. It would completely wall Loudred, because neither of them could do anything that wasn't neutral, even. Plus, this thing has monster defense. Then, Aron, even Mud Slap, would only be, like, just barely a 3 KO of even, and it can 2 a KO Aron with Shockwave. Not only that, but with Magnet Pull, I can't take it out to heal. So, yeah, it's kind of a lose lose situation. Alright, it's just going for Sonic Boom. Just gonna go for Rock Smash. And do absolutely nothing as expected. And it's going for Thunder Wave. I don't really care about that. I have Paralyzed Heals that I bought off screen and such. And of course, I don't get the defense drop that time. And now for the horrible move. Which surprisingly didn't do that much, but whatever. Okay, good, another defense drop. 
And let's see, another Rock Smash, and I don't know why it went for Sonic Boom right there. Alright then. And Super Potion, not surprised, whatever. Okay, another Shockwave. Again, I don't really care about that. But I do care about that! Well, missed at least. Come on, defense drop. Yeah, and after two defense drops, that still does barely any good. I got a third defense drop. So yeah, this thing is kind of annoying. Critical hit! Uh. Alright then. Hopefully the extra damage done to it, plus those three defense drops, Mud Slap can actually be kill it in two hits. And great, it's going for Shockwave right away. Uh... What? Why'd it do so much more? Last time it wouldn't even go down to 30. Screw you, Min Max. Alright then. I finally beat that Magneton! Hooray! Ugh. I'm just gonna go in and Kata so I can heal up Arnon. Ugh. Actually, no. Super Potion would work better. Anyway, um, now for Manectric. It's male, level 24. Pure electric type, its ability is static. It's holding a citrus berry, so you definitely want to watch out for that. Its moves are Quick Attack, Thunder Wave, Howl, and Shock Wave. So essentially, in terms of not only being an evolution, but in terms of move, it's basically a stronger version of his Electrike. But it also has a citrus berry. I'm going into Aron first to get in a few mud slaps. All right, there's one. I don't know why it's spamming out unless it knows I have a grow vial. So it can use quick attack against me with it. Well, I doubt Manetric can win a KO on with Shockwave anyway. Especially if Magneton couldn't. Wow, that actually did a bit more. Alright, good. The Citrus Berry. Now I don't have to deal with that when I go into Grove Isle. And I know Shockwave, you know, always hits and such, but to be honest, Shockwave isn't going to do much to Grove Isle. And I only have one Pokemon left in No Revives because I can't buy any. Ugh. Now come on, I just got Hope Bullet Seed does more than two hits. KIDDING ME! At least I got a crit and it's hitting more than twice. Okay, another crit. Okay, four times, two of which were crits. I can actually live with that. And of course it hit with Thunder Wave. Ah. And of course fully paralyzed. Ah. And it keeps spamming how, um, at this rate, if it gets a quick attack, and it'll be like a 1 KO or something ridiculous like that. Ugh. Yeah, this is doing absolutely nothing. Seriously, Grobo is supposed to be good. Why is it sucking so much? Why can't it learn Leaf? Why does it have to wait until, like, level friggin' 29 to learn Leaf Blade or something even worse? Uh, at least it's not doing any better than I am. He better not have another Super Potion. I mean, I swear, if he uses another Super Potion, I am going to kill someone. I am serious. And not just a Pokemon, either. I'm going to kill Watson. Ah. Uh. Uh. I love how he kept using Hal, and now he's just going for Shockwave all the time. Ah! 
It's only a 25% chance. Come on. Grovile, you are better than this. Okay, good. It missed. Missed again. Good. Ah, this is so tense. Seriously, if you have a Combuskin or a Marsh Jump, you have this so easy. Because for Combuskin, you know, just double kick. And then for Marsh Jump, you know, just... You're immune and everything. And oh, thank you, I finally beat him, and you don't even have the courtesy to... Give me a level up. Wah! Fine, I lost. You ended up giving me a thrill. Take this badge. With the Dynamo Badge, Pokemon can use Rock Smash outside of battle. And you will make your Pokemon a little bit faster, too. <laughs> you should take this, too. That TM there contains Shockwave. It's a trustworthy move that never misses. You can count on it. Screw you! I am out of here. Just go die. And the reason I kept giving him that voice because I have a feeling he's possessed or something. Ugh, I hate him. He's never given me trouble until this go through, of course. But we finally got done. All right then. Next time we're gonna do some other stuff. Now that we beat Watson, I'll see you then. Ah.